we will discuss what it means to have elevated alkaline phosphatase levels, or ALP. Alkaline phosphatase is an enzyme found in many parts of the body, including the liver, bones, kidneys, and bile ducts. When levels of this enzyme are higher than normal, it can be a sign of issues in one of these areas, so it is important to figure out the exact cause to treat it properly. Elevated alkaline phosphatase levels can occur for different reasons, often related to the liver or bones. For example, liver problems like bile duct obstruction, hepatitis or cirrhosis can cause alkaline phosphatase to increase because the liver or bile duct cells may become stressed or injured. Similarly, bone diseases such as Paget's disease or osteomalacia, which involves weak and poorly mineralized bones, lead to increased alkaline phosphatase because this enzyme is actively produced during bone repair or growth. When a doctor sees that alkaline phosphatase levels are elevated, they will try to determine the source of the problem. This usually starts with asking about symptoms. For instance, if someone has yellowing of the skin, fatigue, or abdominal pain, these might suggest a liver problem. Bone pain or deformities, on the other hand, could indicate a bone-related issue. Blood tests are often the next step. To check if the liver is involved, tests may measure bilirubin and other enzymes like alanine transaminase or aspartate transaminase. If these levels are also elevated, the liver or bile ducts may be the source. Another important enzyme called gamma-glutamyl transpeptidase is often measured to confirm this. If the issue was suspected to be related to the bones, a blood test for calcium phosphate and parathyroid hormone can provide important clues. High levels of both calcium and parathyroid hormone alongside alkaline phosphatase might point to a bone-related problem like hyperparathyroidism. Imaging tests can also help pinpoint the cause. For example, an ultrasound can check for blockages or other abnormalities in the bile ducts or liver. If a bone issue is suspected, a bone scan may reveal areas of increased activity, which could indicate conditions like Paget's disease or cancer that has spread to the bones. In some cases, the doctors use a test that separates the alkaline phosphatase from different part of the body to determine if it's coming from the liver, bones, or somewhere else. This is called an isoenzyme analysis and can be particularly useful when the cause is unclear. Once the cause is identified, treatment focuses on addressing the underlying issue. For example, if there is a bile duct obstruction, this might require surgery or other procedures. Bone diseases like Paget's disease might be treated with medications that regulate bone metabolism, along with supplements like vitamin D to strengthen the bones. In summary, elevated alkaline phosphatase levels are not a disease in themselves but a sign that something in the body may need attention. By looking at symptoms, running the right tests, and sometimes using imaging, doctors can figure out the cause and start treatment to manage the condition effectively.